I just got to Ibiza, Spain, um, spending the first part of my holiday for my birthday here, um, staying at a Hotel Ibiza Playa and it's right on the water so it's really close to the beach and um, I just wanted to show you guys the hotel. So when you walk in you have the bathroom which I haven't seen a tub in a very long time so I might have to take a bath. Toilet. Okay. Me. have the bed, little desk area, closet, which I hope I might have to get an iron. I kind of need an iron. And let's see what the view is. Wow. Go lay up myself. Hello everyone. Um, I'm currently in Ibiza. It is absolutely beautiful. Um, doing my morning run. I really like to run in the morning um, mostly because I get energy from running and it's like the first thing I always do. But what I've noticed traveling to these other countries is the sun rises like later and later in the day. So like this morning, I woke up at 6 a.m. and I was like, all right, let me get this run in before my cousin comes because she's coming to celebrate my birthday with me. And yeah, the sun doesn't come up till eight. So my cousin lands at 8.45. So I basically am running right now until she lands or at least she gets her bags and then I'm gonna meet her at the hotel but um, oh, here's the seagull <laughs> but yeah it's, it's it's interesting it's like I don't know maybe because we're going into the fall and winter uh, but yeah it's 8 30 right now I just finished two miles I'm gonna try to fit in two more miles before she gets here uh, but I just had to show you this view like I had to stop and just take it all in everyone today is day two in Ibiza and we are going to Formentera so we're taking um me and my cousin is here we're taking this boat taxi or ferry bus over to Formentera so here it comes just got off the boat from Ibiza to Formentera and me and my cousin were damn near sick um, just it was just entirely too rocky for us but we made it um, now we are exploring not really sure a lot of the things to do here is on a boat which is not what we want to do so we're gonna see um, what the beaches look like it's pretty warm and relatively sunny today so We'll see what we get into. Me and my 
cousin are currently trying to find a nude beach. <laughs> um, we think we're on the right direction, but this is kind of where we came from, so possibly not, but let's try. Okay, so we actually found um, some bike rentals, but these are some very raggedy bikes and we're afraid to go fast on them because they probably will break down. Um, but we're on our way to one of the beaches and it's supposed to be a new beach. It's supposed to be one of the nicest beaches on the island, but we got lost once already. So we're gonna, it was definitely my fault. <laughs> so now we're going to try to get there. We're halfway there. We had to take a water break because uh, it's a lot of energy working these bikes. It's hot and like these bikes are not sturdy at all. And like, I just, I just want you guys to see, see the rust on these bikes. Like not the safest, but we're gonna make it. Ting, ting, ting. Okay, after several wrong turns, and a 14 minute bike ride that was supposed to, well it was supposed to be 14 minutes it turned into damn near an hour we made it to Iletes, this beach Iletes. and like i said it was supposed to be a new beach we don't see any nudists here so maybe we are at the wrong beach maybe we got the wrong information but we made it here wait nope i see some no never mind no i don't no i don't <laughs> So we're gonna lay out here for a few minutes then we're gonna have to head back because it took entirely too long for us to get here. So let me show you this beach. We're walking up this hill. Not sure where we're going. It seems to be some kind of castle, cathedral-esque looking thing and we're gonna find out more so on the journey coming up to i'm guessing the side of a castle because like i said we still really don't know where we're going um we came across this beautiful view so we had to take pictures and stop and just kind of just take it in but there's still another level we have to go up uh but as of now let me show you this view on this level Yep, so we're walking up to this other level. We're walking on the flat land <laughs> because those cobblestones are pretty hard on the ankle. So, yeah, this definitely looks like the side of the castle where they used to defend against invaders we kind of saw like cannons over here yeah you can kind of see i'll get a closer video of cannons so like i was saying earlier looks like we have cannons here they look pretty real and i'm guessing they would defend this fort we'll call it from intruders pretty cool So here's the view at the top of this fort. It's gorgeous. Today is our last day in Ibiza. Well, as you can see, it's nighttime right now. Um, I had to get these tuna empanadas. They are amazing and I wanted to share this experience with you as this is last night. Uh, we're leaving to Madrid tomorrow, so there'll be another video on that. Um, but it gets pretty chilly out here. Like, as you can see, 
bundled up. They so nicely gave us a blanket. I have some tea right here, some um, actual like mint and natural ginger in here brewing. But yeah, these are amazing. Like. I'm a little sad they only had two left, so I have to give the other one to my cousin because I wanted two for myself, but here we are. So, until next time, guys. Bye.